this the place? Greetings, Witcher. It's nearby. Ready? Lead the way. Splendid. Come. The King of Beggars, man. His name is Tin Boy. What do you know about him? Not much. He's easy to ire, so tread carefully. We need him far more than he needs us. You were to come alone, Elf. Who's this? A concerned friend. Ah, fine. Here's how we see things. The boss at Loggerheads with Cleaver, there's got to be a payoff. We've got an offer, and it's non-negotiable. Surprise us. A steady supply of iron in exchange for 50% of your profits. You're kidding, right? We'll give you ten. Geralt, what are you... Be quiet. You're fucking with fire, git. I don't have to haggle with you. Final offer, faulty. Give you 25. Who are you to dictate anything to the King of Beggars? Ugh, 35's as low as we'll go. Twenty-five's our limit. We'll throw in a discount at the shop. <laughs> You're clearly daft, tramp. No deal. Come on, boys. Fine. We'll take your offer. But perhaps we should... You should go home, elf. Agreed. Pleasure doing business with you. Oh, tin boy. Too much drink. It softened your bloody mind. This here's Cleaver's territory, you prick whittler. Damn it. Who's this now? Cleaver's boys! News <gasps> travels fast! Geralt, what do we do? Oh. That's it. Oh. 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 Leg it! This way! Geralt, quickly! There could be more. Follow me. What now? What now? Right. Sure hope there's a payoff at the end of this. So, supplies. That's something we can count on? Who'd you take me for? Gave you me word, didn't I? But I'd hire guards if I was you. You never know with Cleaver. Think they'll come back? A few of Cleaver's little shits escaped. Bugger probably already knows everything. I've no men to spare, can't guarantee your safety. If I was you, I'd lay low for a time. Thanks, Tin Boy. Down the line, the bosses will make a deal. You'll be left alone. All you gotta do is stay alive till then. <laughs> what now? Here we chat, while your partner's just flown the coop. Damn it. Hey, wait! <laughs> Good luck! Hattori, wait! Look 
looking to make some coin too. We'll have order at last! Long live Ranovin! Hail! Redania. Hattori, you in there? Open up. No chance. Leave me be. Don't be silly. Let me in. No, never. I shall stay in here until Middenvern. Forgive me, Geralt. That was a mistake. To parley with bandits, make deals. Too late now. King of Beggars will get you supplies, and then what? You'll have to pay him. What have I done? Geralt, you must help me! No, I won't. I'm a witcher, not a bodyguard. Precisely! You must find me a bodyguard! Geralt, I beg you! They'll kill me! Got anyone specific in mind? There's a mercenary, Sucrus, often drinks at the Sturgeon. He's an old pirate, a Skelliger. He used to work for me. Huge as an oak, wouldn't fear a dozen cleavers. Can't you talk to him yourself? We parted... not on the best of terms. That is to say, he demanded a bonus and I... Didn't pay him. Great. What now? Am I supposed to pay your dues? I'm certain you'll find some way to agree. Geralt, please don't leave me this way. Hattori, still building barricades? Still. I'll be back. Don't leave me here! Crow, back on the yard. Where you go? Get her, sick. The downfall of civilization. My wife's mum's an old succubus. Have from the distant south. Just help. Help. Save me. Need something sharpened? Reforged? What do you have on offer? So long. Yes, I should interject. <clears throat> what the fuck are you doing? We weren't done conversing. Call that a conversation? Not your plowing business. You need a smack, is that it? Sorry, but you asked for it. I'm Geralt. Sucrus. You did well, mate. An ale to patch things. Come, we'll talk inside. What brings you here, Geralt? Looking for a bodyguard. Interested? Why not? If there's coin in it. Well, there isn't. Not yet. So we're to barter. Favor for a favor, huh? I'm gonna kill you, Tori. Yeah, I guess. What did you have in mind? My brother-in-law owes me some coin. Get it back and we'll talk. <sighs> Damn it. I'll do it. Where'll I find him? Nearby at the docks. 
You know what? I don't care for his coin or not. If you don't get it back, I won't mind. So what do you want me to do? Smash his stock of mead. Was me brought it in from Aunt Skelly. That a mature thing to do? Nay, but it's fair. Sucrus's collector. Come to get it. Mr. Sucrus, the man's a boor. I do not deal with illiterate peasants. Tell him I'll pay just as soon as palm trees sprout on Skellige. I don't have time for this. So long. Right away, the best deals this yeah. side of the pond. What now? You, you mean so lazy right now? Swordsmith. Seems you know each other. I be your Hattori, the elf. Tried swindling me on axes once, the bastard. You working for him? You could say that. We're trying to dismantle the swordsmithing monopoly in Novigrad. Oh, noble cause. Well, you're vouching for him. Don't see why not. I'll grab some of the boys and we can go. Geralt, 
I've yet to thank you for your help with Tin Boy. I'd never dreamt I could get away with paying so little. I have something for you. Thanks. How are things with Sucrus? All is in order. I can pay him now. Finally accepting orders for swords again? Sadly, no. I lack certain crafting supplies. Let me guess. Ernst van Horn's got a monopoly on them as well. Just so. He bought them cheap from sword makers abandoning the trade. Now he hoards them like a squirrel. But if you... No. You'd never agree. Agree to what? I happen to know where Van Horn keeps his hoard. It's more than he could possibly ever use. We could borrow a little. What are you getting me into? Borrow? Don't you mean steal? Stealing from a thief's no crime. It isn't? So what is it? Poetic justice? How did I get sucked into this? And why? It's simple. The best swords you've ever seen. Armor, trebuchet, catapults. All right, all right. Assuming I agree, how do you see this? Van Horn has his warehouse at the docks. The materials I need are very heavy. You must ask Sucrus to take his boys. Uh, one more thing. The crates I need will smell of ammonia. We choked to death on three to get smoke. Greetings. Oh, Geralt. How are things? Hattori's got a job for us. Great. I was starting to get bored. Wants us to borrow a few crates from Ernst Van Horn's warehouse. They'll smell of ammonia. Mmm. Sounds doable. I know where Van Horn stores his goods. The boys and I will go there, look around. Meet us near the sturgeon. Fine. When? After dark, of course. See you there. Now they've got their new king, perhaps the Skelligers will calm down. My wife's mum's an old right. shit. What a freak. Look, look! Boring as fucking shit. Not now. Come see me after. sensitive. I'll not find the right crates, so you gotta mark them with chalk. We'll get a cart in the meantime. Fine. What do I do when I'm done? Just leave the warehouse. Then we'll go in. swindler I told you about. Are you following me, you scoundrel? Ah, plowing nonsense. I knows him. It's Witcher Geralt. How goes it, Master Witcher? A Witcher? Well, it all makes sense now. Mr. Dwarf, do not listen to him. The bastard will curse us. You trade heads with Troll. A friend of Yap and Zigrin's a friend of mine. Now sod off for I lose my temper. No! Abracadabra, hocus pocus. How goes it, Master Witcher? Anything specific you're looking for in Van Horn's warehouse? Your Zigrin sends his regards. By Rune Durin, just don't nick everything. And hurry, get it done while I'm in the privy. My old shit. 
Where are those crafting supplies? Must be it. Does stink of ammonia. That'd be it. Gotta signal them now. This is goat fucker! Oi, Garrett. It's a bloke Atari told us about. The bugger who sleeps with Cleaver or something. Sucrus? Why are you here? With the sorcerer? Oh, now I see. That is one hell of a jest you pulled. Hattori sent you! That plowy non shoe will be sorry if Mother didn't strangle him with his navel string. But first, we'll feed you to the crabs! Hands off my brother-in-law, swine. Only I can thrash him. Understood? Brother, let's mop the floor with these plowing Nordlings. Join us, Geralt. Adam. Give him here, Sukris. Twirsang! with this fighter. Sucrus, forgive me. I love you like a brother, you unkempt bugger. Friends? Of course, friends. What good has Becker ever brought us? Where's that Dracker that hit me? Don't mean to spoil your reunion, but what'll we do with Van Horn? We'll take him to Skellige before he comes too. Won't be any more trouble to you. And maybe we'll try a new venture. But first we have to move these crates to Hattori's. True. I had to pay him a visit, too. Hey there, handsome. Greetings, Ibeer. Geralt, you return safe and sound. I do. You doing all right? Never better. Once Van Horn had finally left, Cleaver lost interest in swordsmiths. I can forge swords again without fear of my workshop going up in flames. Glad to hear it. You've no notion how glad I am. Have no need of sucrus anymore and can devote myself to what I truly love. I thank you, Witcher. So now can you craft me something extraordinary? Naturally. It is what we agreed. Give me a few days, then come by for your new sword. Greetings, Ibeer. Greetings, Geralt. How might I be of help? My sword ready yet? It is. Behold and admire. A sword to outshine all others. 
Well, this was worth the wait. Thank you, Ibeer. It is I who thank you. For everything. What do you have on offer? Oh. Ooh. Lots ah. of black ones are chasing gorillas around the Kedweni woods. Novograd safe. Oi, grey knight. Oh. Oh. Protect Siri from the Wild Hunt, and the Emperor will grant you amnesty. I hope we can trust you. You can. What of Fringilla? That I don't know, but I shall take it up with him. You barely said hello, and you're already plotting something. It's clearly in our nature. You're right. You convince the Emperor to pardon them? Provided they help us defend Ciri. Hmm. <sighs> Got a hard time believing Emperor would go in for a deal like that. If you can't believe it, don't. I don't need you to. Bit about Frangilla. What was that? Triss told me you couldn't contact her. Perhaps because she sits in the Emperor's dungeon, chained in Dimeritium. At least that's what Rita implied. How's Rita now? Barely got out of prison herself. She spoke to Fringilla before they imprisoned her. Fringilla said that the Emperor had summoned her and she'd explained why after the meeting. No one's heard from her since. Thought this kind of drama only happened around Radovid. I don't like it. That was not our deal. When it's all over, I'll need to have a candid discussion with the Emperor. Come, they're all waiting for us. Whoa! Oh, you make a fine sight. All are present. You were the last to arrive. Might we set sail? Anchors away. That settles the question of his Imperial Majesty's whereabouts. Does he aim to conquer Skellige? But he, he knows. Those are my friends. He wishes to grant you the Isles, with Sintra and the rest of the Empire. There is an upside to all this. Is that so? The Emperor will have to help us fight the hunt. And we've just found Frangilla Vigo. We must hurry and find the Sunstone. Seems we've plenty to do in Skelliger after that. Fringilla Vigo. We need her here. Can you teleport me onto Amir's ship? Not a chance. It's better shielded than the Emperor's alcove. Though we could try to force our way through. We need Fringilla in one piece. Think they know we're here? Amir's mages? Of course. If the matter of Fringilla Vigo were resolved, they'd probably just send her over here in a skiff. It's far from resolved. The Emperor pledged to ensure the Lodge's safety, but... Fringilla's a pricklier matter. She's his subject. 
one officially sentenced to death for treason. You'll need to learn what Amir has planned for her, once we've found a way to toss you over to the Imperial flagship. I'll get on the Emperor's ship myself. A plan to swim? With swords on your back? You'll get shot up like a sitting duck before you can say, the white flame dancing on the graves of his foes. Don't panic. He'll find a way. Make your approach by night. You'll stand a better chance then. And once you're on board, show His Imperial Majesty this letter. Hand it to him directly. We should remind him what he promised, and what he'll get in return. At the moment, we don't even know what the Sunstone is. It was created so the Mountain Elves could summon the vessels of the NL. Now it merely serves as a symbol of a lost opportunity to unite the two tribes. Truly? Can all of you be unfamiliar with the story of Gelban and Dillion of the White Fleet? The Sunstones in Skellige? How do we know that? From legends. Elven ones. It lies where the White Fleet landed centuries ago. Meaning anywhere on any one of the Isles. Splendid. Ermion. I'll talk to him. Know where he is? I'll ask around the port. Croc's longships are moored there. I'm off. Good luck. in their rickety tubs. They bay at our gates, seek to strike fear in our hearts. Saw them all. Where's Ermion? Went to see Lugas. An uncrate on the throne remains a thorn in his ass. <laughs> now he's seen the black ones, it pricks him even harder. The druid's gone to reason with the dim-witted knob. Think I'll join Ermion. Need to talk to him. Go. And when you see that bloody twit Lugas, be sure and tell him... Uh, best not. The druid knows what to say. Farewell. Clumsy sot. Hey! <sighs> A man in need. Who are there, Witcher? That's it, Roach. It's true what they say. No cure for trouble like a witch. Uh. Mommy? What you got I'll not kneel before an oncrite, never. That clear to you? You prefer to aid the black ones? 
I'd sooner write the rights of bleeding Morhawk than let Crack rule all Skellige. And your men, what do they say? Will they follow you when the Yars call you a traitor? This here's my land, Druid. Watch your words. What would you call it if not treason? That your bark before you bite. Did Crack send you here for my head? Well then go ahead! Try to take it! Get him! Dear. That's enough. Wait, wait. Come. 
Well, Geralt, I see no row can occur in Skellige without your participation. Mean and inaccurate, Ermion. Seems to me I've missed quite a few. The blood of Crocs' blood sits upon the throne, and that is your doing. I'm afraid you've ignited a small civil war. For ages, men had shed each other's blood in the quest for Skellige's crown. Politics as usual, just a difference of degree. Yet the bloody feast at Kaer Trolda was different. It was dishonorable, treacherous, needed investigation. More witcher's work. Work that culminated with the crowning of the Isle's new queen. So, Clan Drummond will attack sooner than we expected, it seems. Thought Croc sent you to negotiate an agreement with Lugas. Ha! <laughs> an agreement? Only Croc believes such a thing possible at this stage. You mean I didn't actually ruin things for you? Not this time. Lugas' death stands to change a great deal. His cousin, who will now be named Jarl, is a weak commander. Stupid. This war will start soon, and even sooner. But why have you returned to Skellige? Listen, Ermian. Know anything about the Sunstone? Legends place it somewhere in Skellige. The Mask of Urberus first, now the Sunstone. Monsters may rest easy. You've become a treasure hunter. I've never found the Enshe Elves interesting. But there's a Skald, Avent. He could help you. Once told me of some inaccessible caverns or ruins or some such. Where will I find him? Today? In Arambjorn, doubtless. You might also ask the pearl divers, Erling and Matthias Fishlung. Of late, they hunt near the tip of the bay, eastern end. Fishlung? Interesting. So they call him. Submerges for hours at a time. None know how he does it, but I've my suspicions. Hmm. Not too fond of him. It's nothing personal. I couldn't stand his father or grandfather either. Thanks for your help. One thing, Geralt. These caves are ruins. Matthias and Erling's ancestors would have looted them bare centuries ago were they not protected by some magic barrier. Take a sorceress with you. You must have brought at least one along. Oh, gaggle this time. Ah, uh, gods protect us. This here's a calm village. Let me hold you, sorry. I've always wondered, what do you witchers do once there are no basilisks, flesh, giants? No challengers to be seen. That are shall not. Ha! We begin. He fell Not now. Watching for Nilfgaard's fleet. Fleet? Oh, aye, they mentioned something. Nay, hey, I've more important matters on my mind. By my calculations, today's the day Gevorg, the legendary white whale, will swim the waters of Skellige. Been waiting for this my whole life. What's this whale about? He's to appear when specters descend from the heavens into the waves. The serpent wakes the sea's wrath, and an icy monster devours an isle. Be the first bard to compose a ballad about him. Legends don't happen to mention a curse of the Black Sun, do they? Black Sun? 
What do you want about? Never mind. Let's watch for Gevorg together, and you can tell me what you know about any elven ruins in Skellige. Heard of some cavern no one's been able to enter? Good thing, too. Elsewise, they'd have plundered it long ago like all the others. Avond. What? I... Uh, just wanted to assure you I only want to look around the cavern. It's research. Research? Writing an adventure novel. Gathering material for it. Mean to write up the coming of the White Fleet? Prime idea. Mayhaps you could use my translation of the Song of Gilban and Dillion. Gladly, gladly. So where's this cavern? Uh, gotta sail east from Kertrolda. Caverns in a cove, only accessible from the sea. So long, and good luck with the White Whale. It'll show today. I'm sure of it. <laughs>